Cake of Geeks. I hope you guys are doing really great. I wanted to tape a few review videos today because it's been a while since I've gone makeup shopping, which, okay, a while for me, let's be honest, it's just a couple months for everyone else. It's like, oh, six months. No, Marlena, it's two months. That's, you know, a pretty dry spell for her. <laughs> um, but I love getting to experiment with makeup products. That's what got me into this business in the first place because I love makeup. I love color. I love texture. And so everything about makeup is just really fun for me. So I love getting to experiment with different makeup products and see what's out there. Um, so I went to Sephora, Ulta, a um, couple drugstores, got some cool stuff that I think would be fun to review for you guys. And I wanted to do a drugstore makeup to or, um, uh, review today because it's been a while since I've reviewed any drugstore stuff. And um, my friend Adette was telling me about Alme has these liquid lip balms. And I'm not really familiar with All May because I don't really buy much from them. It's not a huge brand for me. But um, I did see these at Ulta and I thought, okay, let me try these out because I was intrigued by the colors. So let me show you guys the three colors that I got. I think the ones I saw at Ulta, I think they had like five or six colors, but they were kind of out of stock. My Ulta is always out of stuff. I'm not sure what the deal is. But um, I think I paid $8 for these. Right now it was buy two, get one free. So great deal on them. And I love how in the container they're just very sleek. And I love how it's just a uh, very simple packaging. It's easy to access. And I love how it has the doe foot wand. You guys know for me personally, I like the doe foot wand a lot better than the, um, the brushes. I think brushes for me are messy because I'm always applying this in the car. And the last thing I want to do is be messing with a brush and getting it all over my face. So doe foot wand for me, I like a lot better. It's just a little bit easier to apply. So I love the packaging. I love how sleek it is. I like that it's simple. I love how pigmented the colors appear in the thing. Now the only thing I didn't like, I'm wearing this peach one here. This is the color cantaloupe. So it's a really pretty peach color, but when you go to apply it, when you start to spread it out, it's actually really sheer. So it looks really pigmented in the container, but when you go to apply it, it really shears out. So if you're one of those girls that you like a sheer wash of color, these would be great. But if you want something that's very pigmented, I wouldn't say these would be the best thing for you. The texture of these is really nice. It's not too sticky. You guys know that my lip glosses, I hate sticky lip glosses. Like it's my number one pet peeve. I hate having hair get stuck in it. My tissue gets, you know, if I blow my nose, it gets stuck to it. And it's just this whole disaster. It gets all over my face. I hate, hate, hate uh, sticky lip glosses. But these aren't sticky. They have just a little bit of tackiness, but not bad at all. And they're very glossy too, which is kind of a cool thing because normally glossier lip glosses are very sticky in texture, but this isn't. So the texture is really nice. The only thing I don't like is that they don't have a wide range of colors. I only saw five or six and the um, pigmentation's not as intense as it should be. But I think it feels really nice on the lips. It's very moisturizing. It just feels really nice and it's just great for a really natural, subtle look if that's what you're going for. Um, so I will say I like them. I'm not like blown away and pressed, but I think it's still a good product uh, worth checking out. So let me do a couple swatches for you guys and I'll post pictures of these on the Makeup Geek site too so you guys can check out the colors. Um, but this one here is the color Cantaloupe and it's a really pretty peachy color. Hopefully that's picking up on camera a bit, but that's really nice. It's like a peachy coral. And this one here is Lilac Love and that's kind of a purpley color. I'm really into purple lips right now. I'm not sure why. I think just because it's different because I always, you guys know me, I always do pink lips. I'm kind of boring like that. So I'm trying to branch out and do some purples. I really like that this was a purple one. So when I saw it, I was like, oh, purple. Let me grab that. <laughs> this is Rosy Lipped. And it's kind of a uh, nudie pink color. So it's not like straight up Barbie pink. It's kind of a, um, just kind of a muted one. I'm trying to get enough products so you guys can see it. So there's the three colors about there. I saw a red one and I think another nude color one. But again, my Ulta is usually out of stock on stuff, which I'm not sure why. <laughs> so anyways, click on the link below. I'll give a full detailed review of this product here. I think they're worth checking out. And again, I'll post pictures and swatches for you guys. So check that out. But I really hope you guys are doing great and have fun with your makeup shopping. And I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.